Previewing race number four now, and this on the turf over the distance of 1,200 metres. Flying bonus at the top of the program has the pacifiers off. The Hulk on a seven-day backup from the 1,400 back to the 1,200. Mighty Valor wears a tongue tie for the first time. Kamasi goes from the 1,000 up to the 1,200. He was placed there in Australia private prior to arriving. Lightning Bolt, a first starter for Danny Shum, was known as Aylesford for William Knight in the UK. Angels Hunter was Coulier for Bjorn Baker, now with Paul O'Sullivan and Super Fortune Tom from the 1,000 up to the 1,200. Yeah, so he's drawn barrier number 11 here, so he's likely to get to rolling for with Joe Maria and find uh, the front, but uh, in his last couple of races, uh, Paul, he's been put under pressure at the 400 and there hasn't been a lot to offer. Yeah, that was over a 1,000. Now with the 1,200 metres, I think he can probably just try and dictate from the front. Uh, flying bonus is probably the one that is likely to put, try and put some pressure on uh, with Alfred Chan aboard. Uh, quadruple double, um, he won't be too far away either. We're going to start with a super fortune, Paul. He looked really good on debut. Since then, he hasn't been anywhere near as sharp. No, he's, he stayed on OK, I thought. He's run fourth in both these. And I think this is a lot easier race for him. He, he, you know, he's up against Cordyceps 6, Carroll Street in this particular race. And there's no, none of those horses in this one. Uh, he's get comes in with a lightweight as well. So I'm going to give him a chance. He jumped fast and just ran with the choke out a little bit, I thought, in those uh, early stages of that race. And then, of course, uh, was beaten here. Of course, we've got El Kari there. He's been uh, racing in uh, terrific form. But he was under pressure at the 400 metres. I think uh, there's a few question marks about him at the moment now. And the step up in trip goes around the bend for the first time too. War of Courage is never too far away. Tom, how do you see him in this lineup? Yeah, he ran a really good race, I thought, behind Romantic Warrior, who's uh, one of the top chances in the final race. And uh, here he was only beaten two links. Of course, that horse on the fence there is Team Spirit. He came out and won the other day. So I like the way he stayed on. Just a, a one time course and distance winner here, Paul. Yeah, he goes in for me as well. War of Courage. Look, he looked really good earlier in his career, especially down that straight thousand. But look, his last couple of runs have been good, and he stayed on really nicely here. Gets a better draw too. Barrier 14 into barrier number 6 for this week's race. And Speedy Mouse Paul onto the all weather for a trial. He runs into a smart one here in California Spangle. Yeah, look, he was quite consistent. He's just a one-time winner from his uh, nine starts. He's going to get his opportunity, I thought, from barrier number 2. The trial was good enough here. So another one that goes in for me. Hasn't been seen since the 21st of November when he was third behind California Spangle, beaten three lengths, but he still stayed on pretty well there, I thought, after being slightly crowded at the start. Not a lot of pressure put on him in that uh, trial, so I'm going to go with him here as Speedy Mouse from a, a low draw of barrier two. And finally, before we get the selections, Lightning Bolt is a newcomer to Hong Kong Racing for Danny Shum. He's had four trials behind some really nice horses in all of them. His rider is Alexi Bedell, and he was out at track work to have a chat with Nick. Alexi, uh, Lightning Bolt is a newcomer to uh, to Hong Kong. What's been your impression of him so far? He's looked pretty good. Yes, exactly. Um, he seems to be a very nice progressive horse. Um, he's done a, lo a lot of work and preparation uh, since he's in Hong Kong and, and he looks like he's fit enough and ready for this race. Uh, just on his trials, he looks to be a really strong travelling horse and, and last time out he hit the line well. Yes, correct. Um, he showed good speed. Uh, he, he's well behaved, he jumps well, he's very professional and, uh, and he, he, he seems to be a, a nice type of horse and he, he, he showed good abilities during the trial so I'm, I'm looking forward to see what he can do on race day. Uh, and he's, has his track work uh, replicated that as well, what he's been doing sort of in training most days? Yes, he, 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 he's been a great worker, uh, very serious and very professional and, uh, and every, every track work since uh, uh, recently has been, has been great so I'm, I'm very happy. And barrier seven is where you're drawn, obviously, with, with the utmost respect to your rivals. It, it does look a winnable race as well, doesn't it, on debut? Yeah, correct. Um, I think it's all about the jump, but it seems like uh, there is a bit of pace in the race uh, from every gate. So uh, I think it seems pretty pretty simple and straightforward. And just on your association with Danny, obviously, that, that's a pretty good one as well. Some, some nice winners recently and a very healthy strike rate. Yes, yes, correct. Uh, Danny has been a great support uh, since my day one in Hong Kong. So. Uh, I hope I will uh, maintain this connection and, and try my best to uh, win as much as possible. 
There's Alexi. He's looked good in those trials, Paul. Have you got him in? Yeah, definitely. I think he's uh, really one of the main chances, Lightning Bolt. Uh, I've got him in for, as a Quinella horse here behind Super Forge. I'm going to stick with him over the 1,200 metres. This would be a, a good test for this horse. But I just think he, if, as long as he doesn't race too keenly, he can dictate from the front. So he's on top, Lightning Bolt second, Speedy Mouse in there for third. He's got to carry um, 129. But Barry number two, he should, should get a really good run. And War of Courage, what a good run from him behind Romantic uh, Warrior last start. Uh, good race this one, 10-8, 2-7. 2-5 for 10 and 7. I like Speedy Mouse uh, here. I thought he's trialled well enough uh, coming into with us and he wasn't too far away last to start. Quadruple double goes in now. He was back to two runs ago on the all weather. Didn't do too much there but stayed on really well despite a tough trip the last start behind Elon. Super Dobbins come out of that race midweek and won uh, Super Fortune and, and War of Courage. So 2-5, 10 and 7. And that is a preview for race number four. It is the first leg of the Triple Trio.